Alright, hello guys, it's Renegade here, and welcome to another video. Now, today, we are going to be playing Dark Souls Prepare to Die Edition. My favorite, all-time favorite game of all time. Now, some of you might be asking, you've been posting some Dark Souls 3 videos, why aren't you going to make a playthrough of that game? Well, it's because a lot of people are doing that right now, and I want to jump back to the original to show this game's roots, okay? So, now... Without further ado, we're going to jump right in and we're going to play. And also, it's going to be a little bit of a challenge. I'm going to do no summoning ever, except for Solaire, because I want to do his storyline, okay? All right, cool. Let's get in here. I wasn't going to show myself going through the uh, character creation screen, but I forgot how incredible some of the choices for the face to it. Yep, this is the one. Okay, um, like for you guys to meet Onion Mafia. I don't know. Don't hate. Don't hate. Alright, we're gonna get right in. Look at that guy. Look at that guy. Oh, Where desperation. Away. Look, that's us. This is your fate. Oh, gross. Oh, what the heck? Why is my face blue? I'm not blue. Here we are. Here we are. We made it. Naked Asylum Run. Alright. Okay, a few things to mention while I'm going through this part of the game. I do have DS Fix installed because I'm playing on PC and it's nearly unplayable without that. Um, also, I haven't touched this game since Dark Souls 3 came out, so I will be really rusty. However, I still don't think that'll be too much of an issue. And also, I do ask that nobody hates on the game for the graphics. It is kind of old, but it's still really fun, and the mechanics are still incredible, and it's a good game, and I really love it. Hey, big guy. It's lit, guys. Ow. Ow. Cool. Got him. Spoilers, I already knew that ball was coming. Hey, Oscar. Oh, you. You're no hollow. Thank I, goodness. I am too I'm a hollow. Dare How dare you, Oscar? That's right, give me that kush. Oops, wait. Oh no. That health. I'm just gonna Yeah, let's not die in the asylum. Hey, this room looks familiar. Hello. Oh, there used to be a glitch where it would hit him twice there. Flawless. Flawless kill. Good job, go straight ahead. I don't think so. You see, the developers thought you would, like, they, they want you to trust them so that later on in the game you'll trust those messages. But I want you to know if you don't go straight ahead, you get rewarded. That's right. Don't ever follow directions, kids. But one day an undead shall be chosen. Whoa! That's a big birdie. I would say it's lit, but it's already lit. Okay, we're gonna do some leveling. Oh no, it seems as though the elevator to the undead parish is not functional. Whoops, oh, what have I discovered? 
A secret little hole with a bunch of chests with loot? Got it. First try. Ah! Nobody saw that. See, I'm a Dark Souls veteran, so this let's play, you probably won't see a whole lot of dying. And I, when I say that, I mean I'm, I'm not going to be one of those people who records a let's play and they're like, oh, I'm a pro, no death run. And then they die while they're saying it for comic relief, you know? No, I'm serious. Probably won't die. For a little bit, at least. Look, see, usually there's a message here and it says try jumping, but I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. Okay, if you look, oh, I don't know if I can do it. Oh, yeah, see right there that ledge? You can actually get on there, and that's how you jump to get the crossbow. Who? spoilers, I know. Whoa, that's a big dragon. Crazy. How did I know that was coming? Whoa. All right, here's the toughest part of the game so far. Oh. She got shut down by this guy. Try it. Try it, you won't. Ooh. Watch this. Ooh. The Matrix. We're living in it, guys. Okay, also, I'm not going to rest yet. This will be the last thing we do. Yep. This guy's pretty easy. They'll turtle until you hit them once. But if you just knock their shield away, then you can just wreck them. Pro tips from Dark Souls Dead. Yeah, see, I'm just I'm not feeling it, guy. I don't have that much in stock. I, I don't think I'm gonna buy anything. Throw me a bone, will you? You haven't uh, got much time anyway. Right, uh, Julia? Did. Alright. Alright. I didn't want to have to do it. Just, just, just. Sh sh that's right. Give it. Hand it over. Hand it over. Good boy. Just, just, just. Sh Alright guys, here we are. We made it to the second bonfire in Lord Ran in the Undead Burg. And I think I'm just going to stop it here because I want to make these videos maybe 10 to 15 minutes long so that I don't take too much of anyone's time. And uh, I just want to say that I'm really glad that I'm doing this. Oh, hold on. Hold on, I'll get it. Um, I'm really glad that I'm making this series because... Dark Souls is one of my favorite games of all time. Actually, like I said earlier, it is my favorite game of all time. So, I just, I really, I'm really happy finally getting around to doing it. So, I want to thank you guys for, for joining me in this video. And I'd like to encourage you that if you enjoyed what you saw, and if you'd like to see more, leave a like down below. It really helps me out. lets me know what you guys enjoy watching and what you don't. And most importantly, leave any comments telling me what I should play, what I should improve, what I did right, what I did wrong, anything. I just love hearing from you guys. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're new. And that's all. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.